Hey folks, this is Shock, and remember, Sunday, 9 o'clock a.m. Pacific Time, we're doing a live radio show. We will be exposing the lies, errors, and frauds of evolution. We'll be talking a lot about macro evolution, how it has not been proven. And uh, so, let me get over here so this guy can get in this way, and here he goes. Should be a very good show. Excellent show. Peace, brother. Um, I look forward to seeing you guys there. There's going to be a giant chat room open. Let me give us some throttle uh, to get away from this guy so if we don't click into each other. All right, I'll get on this lane. He can get in the left lane. Guys, here's what you do. You see right below this video where it says shotgunout.net or Block Talk Radio. Both of those take you to the same place. And when you get there, go to Shock Radio. Have your speakers on. Click on the show dated for this Sunday. This Sunday. And um, there's going to be a giant chat room that opens right at the start of the show. Actually, it's about five minutes before the show starts. You'll see the giant chat room open there. And I'll see you guys there. It should be great. I'm going to be with my friend Micah. Uh, this isn't Micah right here. <laughs> But although I'm telling Micah he's thinking of getting a CBR Honda. I'm going to be with my friend Micah on Sunday, 9 o'clock a.m. Pacific time. It should be awesome. The lies, the errors of evolution. I hope you guys are there. You know, um, I challenged the thinking atheist to a debate because you know he was bashing me trying to hurt my widow feelings he was bashing me on his radio show you know he does a radio show the same place I do blog talk radio and um I, I what I do is I listen to atheist shows and creation evolutionist shows and um so I'm listening to the show and I didn't know you know I downloaded his show on mp3 and I'm listening to it and all of a sudden they drop my name and he starts bashing me on his show. <laughs> so I said, well, let's see how gutsy this guy is if he's all talk, you know. So I challenge him to a debate. He's an atheist, so he believes in fiction. And I'm a Christian theist, so I believe in non-fiction. I challenge the thinking atheist to a debate and he cowered from my debate challenge. What's that say to you, my atheist friends? What's it say to you? I don't know. I don't know, but it, it certainly doesn't say atheism is confident in its worldview. You know, I challenged the number one most subscribed to atheist on YouTube. The amazing atheist. I call him the amazingly hellbound atheist. I'm not happy about it. I pray for the guy. I wish he'd get a brain and a heart. Become saved repent but I challenged the amazingly hellbound atheist to a debate and he too cowered from the debate challenge I think the reason why the atheist cower is because I used to be an atheist myself a lot of you guys know this and I'm telling you it's full of crapola any worldview that contradicts itself like atheism does cannot be true you know atheists claim that it's possible for God to exist and atheism also claims it's impossible for God to exist that's a con contradiction right there that's like a married bachelor or a round triangle and you know philosophy science has taught you that if it contradicts itself it definitely cannot be true and atheism atheism you contradict yourself so you're definitely not true. This is why the number one most subscribed to atheist is afraid to debate me, the amazing atheist on YouTube, and also the thinking atheist. Got another motorcycle here on the right, coming on. So the thinking atheist power to my debate challenge. Wow, that's a uh, Ninja 250 on the freeway. So I'll see you guys Sunday, putting the hammer down here. I'll see you Sunday, nine o'clock a.m. Pacific time. Be there.
should be good. It should be awesome. There goes my motorcycle brother from another mother, but hopefully the same father, <laughs> getting off. I hope he's a Christian. God bless you guys. See you Sunday.